What's up everybody, it's your boy Roshi here, back with some interesting news. So if you guys remember um, a month ago, uh, Funimation decided to effectively end its partnership with Crunchyroll and we've already started to see the results of that. Um, I've experienced the results of that, one being the removal of season one of Overlord from the Crunchyroll service. So, you know, it's only available on two different places, Funimation and the other source, which is now going to be Funimation's new partner, which is Hulu. So now Funimation is going to be the primary provider of subbed and dubbed anime to Hulu, making it the biggest anime streaming deal in Hulu's history. Not only that, Hulu is going to have first dibs on upcoming anime that will be streaming, as well as starting next year, Hulu and the Funimation app will be the co-exclusive providers of simultaneous releases of sub to anime the same day they air in Japan. This is a huge deal, folks. Big deal. Uh, number one, I'm actually excited about this. And I am excited about this because after dealing with Funimation's streaming service, I found it to be lackluster and extremely buggy and it wasn't a great first impression on me, so I was beginning to get worried. Um, but now that they're going to Hulu, Hulu is actually a very reliable service, folks. It's extremely reliable, they have a lot more users than Crunchyroll, so that is good for all of us. Now, they're saying that they're going to be the co-exclusive co um, premiere places for the, the new episodes, but... You know, obviously we're going to have to wait and see when Dragon Ball and My Hero and all that stuff rolls back around, whether or not, you know, Crunchyroll is really going to get the shaft in terms of being able to premiere these episodes, because if that's the case, Crunchyroll is indeed going to lose a lot of subscribers and they will be migrating to Hulu. If you don't have Hulu already, I think most of us already probably have Hulu. We have like every streaming service. Um, so it would just cause everybody to start canceling their Crunchyroll subscription. And I know I'm probably going to end up doing that because a lot of the anime that I watch, most of the anime that I watch, are Funimation. So I get it on a more reliable service. Um, that is the biggest thing for me. Because I remember when Dragon Ball Super episodes would come out, if you were not like on it, like ready to hit that button, like at the moment the episode dropped, you would be stuck in limbo waiting to watch the episode while you watch everybody else tweeting about it and having a great time saying, oh my god, this episode is so fire. It's kind of like that Squidward, that Spongebob meme where he's looking out the window and, and Spongebob and Patrick are having a good time and he's just inside. That's what it was like if you didn't get in the minute the episode dropped. And Crunchyroll is notorious for server errors and just crashing just on a whim. So I am extremely excited about this new deal yes if you want the commercial free hulu you know it's five extra dollars on top of the six dollars you pay to crunchyroll but it's worth it for something that's going to be more reliable and something that's going to propel anime even further because with a bigger install base that means more people will be watching that means more anime that means higher quality so i am oh i'm, I'm here for this folks i am 100 here for this um so I want to hear from you guys. How do you guys feel about this new deal? Uh, I've been seeing stuff online of people like, oh my God, Funimation's a bunch of backstabbers. They, they switched up on Crunchyroll, but it's like, it's just business. And they did what was good for business. And I think that now that, not, you know, in retrospect, moving to Hulu is going to be good for business. It's going to be good for anime fans. You guys will realize in the future why this was a good move. But yeah, how do you guys feel about this? I want to hear from you guys. Oh, also, yeah, I'm not sure if anybody here reads the My Hero manga, but the latest volume um, dropped yesterday, so, or maybe it was the day before yesterday, but I went and picked it up today, so go ahead, get your read on before season four, because a lot of you have some catching up to do, unless you just watch the anime, but yeah. Looking to hear for it. Looking forward to hearing from you guys. Uh, make sure you give me a like and a subscribe. Follow on all my socials at your Roshi, Instagram, Facebook, Twitter. Check out the merch store. The link to that is down below in the description. Also consider becoming a patron if you will. Not sure if you guys saw, but tier three patrons are all going to be entered in for a drawing to win a PS4 this month. So that's my way of giving back to you guys. So I appreciate you guys as always. But yeah, that's all I got for you guys today, man. 
Hope you have a great day or night, and I will catch you next time.